Representatives of a coalition of Islamic NGOs handed over a memorandum to DAP at its headquarters today, calling for its member, Nghe Kuham, to face disciplinary action, including being expelled from the party. They claimed the Burwas MP had spoiled the unity in this country, following his suggestion to include non-Muslim experts in a special committee to review the competency of state legislators in legislating Sharia laws, as well as the jurisdiction of the Sharia courts as per the federal constitution. Following an uproar, Nye apologised and withdrew his statement, saying that he had received clarification that the special committee was formed by the National Islamic Affairs Council, headed by the Selangor ruler. Meanwhile, the coalition president, Aminuddin Yahya, also called on AMNO to think seriously about its existence in the unity government. Saya cadang AMNO supaya memikirkan dengan serius uh, tentang keberadaan mereka dalam perpaduan ini kerana DAP, sikap DAP ini yang kita tahu saban hari, saban malam asyik nak mencampur tangan agama Islam, asyik nak menekan agama Islam. Macam saya katakan tadi, ini bukan kali pertama, dah banyak kali. YB Ngeh ini dan juga yang lain-lain itu kan termasuk dulu Rama Sami pun asalnya dah keluar DAP lah maknanya mereka konsisten untuk menekan agama Islam The group also expressed their disappointment that they were only received outside of DAP headquarters by Clark and not party leadership such as its Secretary General Anthony Loke Pertubuhan Kebajikan Amal Sejagat Malaysia President Izzat Johari called it an insult after having given Loke prior notice of their intention Last week, former Bersatu Information Chief Wan Saiful Wan Jan questioned the sincerity of Nghe's apology, calling it an old tactic of DAP. Lok responded that Perikatan Nasional won't let go of the Nghe matter because it can only play up three R issues, that is race, religion and royalty.